Welcome to WB Mason Post Game Extra exclusively on SNY.TV. Monday night, the Mets return home and fell to the Cincinnati Reds 4 to 3. 3 3 game in the sixth, and Jay Bruce swinging at the first pitch of the sixth inning, hit his sixth home run, and that was that. I thought Sean pitched very well, and, uh, you know, we, were, we just couldn't, again, get anything going after that. You know, for the most part, I was able to, to uh, keep my changeup down the zone. Obviously, the uh, one to Bruce wasn't where I wanted. Um, but other than that, you know, it was, we did a good job of, of keeping those guys off balance, mixing it up. Um, threw a lot more uh, sliders tonight than normal. Um, usually, you know, fastball cutter changeup, but uh, threw a lot more sliders tonight, and, uh, it, you know, it worked for us for the most part. Markham, he was strong. He got deep in, deep in the game. So, bullpen came in, did a great job. Um, you know, we got some, got some, get had a big inning. We got some runs, but uh, we just couldn't, couldn't finish it out. So, take all the positives into tomorrow and try to build on it. Well, we talked a lot about Joey Votto coming to the game, Player of the Week, but Jay Bruce has been just as hot. He's hurt the Mets in the past, and he did it tonight to Sean Markham, who gave up four runs over six innings. We've said that for quite a while that we've got to execute. We've got to execute very, very well. We can't give up. We can't give up extra uh, extra outs. Uh, you know, we've got to make plays. Uh, we got to get. We got to certainly keep the ball in the ballpark, which has hurt us at times. So, uh, um, yeah, we got to play pretty. Got to play pretty perfect baseball right now. Markham fell behind 3 nothing in the first, in part because of an obstruction call against Ike Davis, but Marlon Byrd with one swing of the bat tied it, a three-run homer in the fourth. Well, Johnny Cueto was in trouble the first three innings all game long, and then after that home run by Byrd, he really turned it on after that and got through five innings and even got the win tonight. A uh, lot more breaking balls than we saw early, a lot more. Um, it, then he's, it's all of a sudden he got command of his slider, which, as you saw, was almost un unhittable at times so uh, I just we saw a lot more a lot more off speed pitch than we did early in the game and the Reds bullpen was spotless they threw four scoreless innings and Araldis Chapman finished it for the save so the Reds take it four to three second game of the series on Tuesday night John Neese goes for the Mets Mike Leak for the Reds our coverage begins with Cadillac first pitch at six o'clock on SNY that'll do it for WB Mason post game extra be sure to join us after every game for exclusive coverage on SNY.TV